So uh, today I came for my friend Christabel's wedding. She's the friend that we actually went to her bridal shower in the last video. And I'm here with my bull cakes, Ada, Hi. Cakes, Hi my school daughter, Hi. Ada. You do that. Oh yeah, take it back. It's a joke now. Uh-uh. All things have passed away. Hi guys, don't listen to her. She's looking so pretty. Hi. Oh, so yeah, all of us, yeah, we've known each other since secondary school, so. It's gonna be exciting. It's gonna be like a nice reunion. Just like the bridal shower. The bridal shower was way too much fun. It's so you missed though because you came late. Pack nice party pack. I just catch you guys up a little bit. Now I'm starting three tomorrow, and even though mommy has been having lots of fun, like that wedding I went to yesterday, cha! It was too sweet though. From the bridal shower to the actual wedding, let me tell you, as a mom and as a young girl at the same time, sometimes you feel like, hey, I'm not having enough fun. I'm not doing enough. But seeing my high school friends I've not seen in years, some of them I've not seen in at least 20 years. Okay, that's an exaggeration. In at least like 12 years since I graduated. Some I haven't seen in five, some I haven't seen in three years since I had my wedding. But it was just too much fun. Like they were playing old school jams and it was just giving us flashbacks. The nostalgia was too much and it was so lit. I cannot even explain how much fun it is. I'll tell you when mom and you say, oh, because of my children, I cannot go out. Try and find child care so that you can go out small and enjoy your life because it really recharges your soul. The happiness that I'm feeling right now, I cannot describe it. And I'll not feel that happiness if I did not go out and hang out with some of my friends. So I'll say, yes, try and make time for you to hang out with your friends and recharge your soul. Anyway, before I go on a tangent, I am packing the things for Naya's birthday. You guys saw now, um, was it like last week I went to Lagos Island? Last two weeks. I think last two weeks I went to Lagos Island. I bought some things for the party pack. I tried to keep this birthday on a budget. Honestly, everything you're seeing here is less than 100k. So for a dozen people, I think it will even be like 50k thereabouts. So very, very wise economical birthday. Like I just thought there's no points. Like I want us to do better in school. Doing extra extra is uncalled for. Like I'm just not in that mood, but at the same time I want to mark it. You get. Anyway, I think I already showed you guys what I got previously. But yes, look at this one. This one is just screaming thick. But it has a watch, it has a phone, um, and it has that's all of, just a watch and a phone. But yeah, I think they will love it. And it's actually 12 in a pack, a dozen, and six are for girls, six are for boys. They are 11 in their classroom, so it's perfect. I also got like number three and happy birthday balloons. I got these cups. So yeah, this is everything. This is bubbles, normal, normal. This is like the thing they blow 
This one is eh, my shop had almost full. This is pin pop. This is like a car chocolate situation. Some hats for her classmates. Her cake is already in the freezer. This is digestives and wafers over there. And a happy hour because apparently chair exotic that I usually prefer is out of stock everywhere. Like I went to they just for some weird reason it was out of stock. So that's what we are doing. So yeah, join me. Let's pack. Yeah, oh, birthday girl, we love you so much. I can't believe my daughter is three. Baby, our first child is three. It's born. No. Mm -hmm. You know you want to see the bone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you're so happy today. Do you know you're three years old? Now, how old are you today? Three years old. Three years old. Three years old. Three years old. Did birthday hell. This is homemade. <laughs> You can tell from the ends. Yes. Sorry. Uh, I made this very simple cake for Naya using the leftover um this thing from Naya's birthday. I mean Miss Oma's birthday. This is the cake. Room. Very very simple. I'm about to go and drop it off in our school and then go to buy some toys for her. First of all, I I rushed to Naya's school to drop party packs and the cake. And look what we have here. So say hi now. No one for you. She said she wants to go to one special toy store to buy a special toy for her goddaughter. Give it up for this godmother! Yay! Godmother of the year. You guys, nice auntie all the way from Canada sent the best gifts. I can't even tell you what it is. The excitement wants to kill me. Like, nice that these people are just showing off. I'm about to call my family members. Let them come and represent. Because all her, her daddy's people are just busting with different moves. Eh? So now we're going to the toy store. I just got my coffee. Maybe that's why I'm so charged. And it's just right around the corner. So let's go together. Then after that, we're going to go to grocery store, buy some snacks, buy cupcake. You know the drill now. So let's go. Okay, so are you excited? Your f she's not your first goddaughter. She's your second goddaughter, isn't it? She's your first. Your first. No wonder. We just got to the place. It's called Tot Toys. And I just want to see what they have in there. So there's a lot of really nice stuff. And I'm not talking about those China cheaper ones. Like look at this little washing machine slash kitchen. This one is like a grocery store. These ones are moderately priced, like 145k. If you actually think of buying for directly from abroad, shipping is converting the price. It adds up to about the same. These ones are like Barbie. And stuff uh, look at this avengers one monster trucks look at the price um so there's this hot wheel one i saw i think it's here over no this is not it though this is not it. i don't know where it is again but this is the one to and i are leaning towards uh, we are leaning towards this one abby <laughs> she's like you're on your own no Look at this little cute piano, it's so cute because the kids can actually sit down and enjoy it. Uh, at least they have nice things. Look at this pony, that's a mess of my age as well. And is this a phone? It's a phone. It's a phone, no? So uh, they really have my kind of toys here, like good quality toys, not even all these chinko ones that I'll spoil after one use. I think these are from like UK, US, that kind of thing. Look at this little mixer, there's even a cake. See, it has different settings on it. Look at this one, the rainbow tea party. Look at this little mopping toy. <laughs> mopping toy is so cute, honestly. I'm, I'm so happy to have discovered them. So thank you for bringing me here. Um, and the best of all, let me show you guys. This is our purchase. Oh, it's already in our basket. I'm coming out. I'll show you this Igbo book. Hundred, one thousand most no words in Igbo. Even sings though. But see, there's so many things to learn, and I'm definitely buying this because I'm not doing a great job teaching my kids Igbo. So this would be a nice tool to have. And yeah, let's go upstairs. There's so much more. I don't even know where to start from. Look at this fire station. Let's shall go upstairs. I'll show you guys what they have there. They have this little fire station. I think I went for this one finally, even though I'm a baker. Because I feel like this one 
she's always interested in like cleaning with glass cleaner mopping sweeping this one is baking i don't know i just feel like she would like this one better this one will expire as we had all these things like this egg and butter there is be much more fun but it doesn't do you get my point though i'm gonna look at our goods in the back i'll show you guys what i got when i get home but i came to get wrapping paper um yeah let's let's try and go let's go she actually went and got the wrapping paper and some snacks she started the snacks and then i came back from town i was excited but girl. really she wasn't Magic of course she opened so up her gifts and she excited. loved her gifts but let me tell you something this girl did not eat cake like which child does not eat cake or icing she didn't want to taste it i was like oh well at least she enjoyed the toys this is her playing with the toys busy too they were fighting for everything of course as usual even the mess was part of the fight too but you see this clean toy she loves it so much even up to now she's happy to clean up any mess and just ready to clean up everywhere everything i got was a hit so all the enjoyment is over and i know i kind of said this in the vlog but i just wanted to retreat that if you're someone that in the past month you haven't hung out with your friends like even if it's your sister but preferably <laughs> people that are not related to you you should try and reach out to your friends like set up a meeting set up a date girls night out girls lunch whatever it may be brunch just hang out catch up with your friends because trust me like, I know it's so easy to get in the funk of motherhood or you can be too, um, maybe too busy with work. Definitely, I can understand that. But try and make time for your friends because even my mom, who's, like, way older, who's middle-aged, can confirm that it's good for the soul. Like, it just helps you to feel reignited. Like, let me tell you something. This past week, I had, like, just this new excitement about life just because, like, my social tank was full. Okay, and I know it's not always easy to have, um like for everyone's timing to be ideal for you to meet and whatnot but just don't be that person that has let go of friendships or any relationships you have outside of your marriage and your kids just because you're married or you're busy with work whatever the case may be at least make it a thing that once in a month once in two months but you're gonna hang out with your friends and do something for yourself you know start your hobbies again i just feel it's good for the soul and i just felt the need to say that i don't know who said to me but i just felt the need to put it out there okay Anyway, I'll see you guys in my next vlog. I just really wanted to say that and get started on my chest. Bye.